will I freaking hate it, but it will sit on my shelf forever. Guys, YouTube made me buy it. It was YouTube's fault, babe. That's why there's these 10 packages in front of the door. I promise. This video is in collaboration with It's MJ here on YouTube, Takara Thompson, Rebecca, Becky. I forgot your last name, babe, as always. I will tag everyone down below. Manahil from Perfume Realm, Justin Av, and Jeanne Antoinette. All my girls, love them all. I will link all their um, their videos down below, but these are my YouTube made me buy fragrances. Honestly, 90 to 95% of my collection was inspired from YouTubers, okay? That's just the truth. And now that I am on Instagram with that fragrance community and Facebook fragrance community, they're just all pushing all these perfumes at me that I just need. I just need them. And I know it. Anyways, guys, YouTube, these YouTubers made me buy it. <laughs> I'm going to shout them out in this video. All their information will be linked in the description bar below. Guys, I'd like to think that I put y'all on, but these people put me on these fragrances. So I'm just letting y'all know. Guys. Okay, guys, so this first one. <laughs> Thank you, Equality Fragrances. You to bomb. I love this fragrance. Guys, if you haven't watched this channel, it goes something like this. Peace. This is Quality Fragrances coming at you from blah, 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 Maryland. Th welcome to my cipher. A cipher is a place in some, 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 some. Like that. Anyways, guys. He can basically talk you out your money real, real fast, okay? I love his channel. He's great. Uh, ex oh, except. No, not except. It's funny, but it just gets me every time. He's like, and for 40 stripper ones, you can get this here fragrance. Yeah, it's just so funny. I'm like, for stripper ones, for real? Can you just say dollars once? No, he can't because that's not him. Anyways. Have you, I, do I even know your real name? I don't know. It's a quality fragrances. He's cool. Guys, he put me on to Pearl by Mansara. If you don't like fig, you will not like this one. So know what fig smells like. I learned that there are no words to, de to describe smells, just the name of the smell. If you know the notes, you will know what this stuff smells like. But we all don't know the notes. I've been studying. I've been trying. I think I'm getting better. You know, getting there. Anyways, guys, back to the fragrance. <sighs> Pearl by Mansara is this fit, this musky fig. A lot of musk, a lot of fig. There is rose in here, but I mostly get like a rose stem. It's like, it's a green. There's like a sharp green in this that... I actually love. I like green fragrances. Mm. He didn't describe this as green though. He described it as like a fruit basket and floral and musk. But all I'm getting is fig, musk, and like a little rose. Not a lot. Guys, this one is a good one. Its longevity is monstrous and it projects as well. Mm. Projection, I think you have to spray no, once it heats up on your skin, it does project. Oh, it's good, guys. It is good. Mm. Thank you, Quality Fragrances. You're the bomb. Next, guys, is Gabriella Francesca. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. If I am not, please forgive me. I love your channel. <gasps> you are a babe. <laughs> and, guys, Gabriella actually commented on my post on IG a little while ago yes I feel like I am a part of the cool kids table nah well kind of guys anyways I love her channel she's like she does um astrology and fragrance which I love astrology ugh, so much 
Anyways, if you were wondering, I am an Aquarius rising, Cancer sun, and Sagittarius moon. If, if anybody wanted to know. <laughs> Nobody asked. But. <laughs> oh, which reminds me, guys, I'm going to do a giveaway and a Q&A very soon, possibly next week, maybe the following, depending, depends when I can get it out. But please comment below with your questions that you want to know. Nothing is off the table. Nothing. Make it crazy. Because the crazier the video is, you know, the more views it gets. That's just a reality. So y'all, make it crazy. Y'all can um, also DM me on IG at Anna underscore absolute if you'd like to do it that way. But yeah, guys, um... I need to do a giveaway because I appreciate you guys so much. Like for real, you guys are subscribing, you guys are commenting, you guys are liking, and I appreciate it so much. Anyways, I am not here. I am not me in front of this camera without you because best believe if I didn't have viewers, I probably wouldn't be doing this. That's just the honest truth. Okay, guys. Anyways, Gabriella put me on to this bomb fragrance. So bomb. She described it as fairies have given you a bath. That's what you smell like, like clean fairies, sweet and clean. After fairies had given you a bath, and I would have to agree. I was like, there's this forest, this magical forest. There are fairies. There is this lovely pool of sweet, fragrant, soft water. This doesn't smell like water, so please that doesn't make any sense. But anyways, <laughs> there's no kind of aquatic notes in here, guys. So sorry for that. Anyways, that sounded good in my head. Let's just go with what she said. She said it smells like fairy soap. Like if fairies were to give you a bath, the soap that they would use, this is what it smells like. And it's magical. Guys, this is Insolence by Guerin. Guys, I'm never going to know or look up how to pronounce these words in French. Why? Because it's funny to mispronounce them. If you don't agree, you're probably not American and you're probably thinking these bloody Americans always talking, always saying anything they want to say. Yes, we do do that. <laughs> anyway, guys, I think it's funny. And that's all that matters. Oh, anyways, guys, yes, insolence by Grand. No offense to the French. I obviously love your products. I, I put a lot of money on these, okay? Guys, it's just to be funny and be annoying. I know, I'm hella obnoxious. My family and my friends tell me that all the time. They'd be like, Anna, shut up. Anna, don't say that. They're strangers. Anna. My mom introduces me to her friends. I, I, in high school, she'd be like, oh, I told, I told you, I warned you. This is what my mom has to say to her friends before they meet me when I say something funny. I warned you guys about her humor, right? Thanks, mom. Thanks. You're ashamed, ashamed of me. Anyways, guys, back to this lovely fragrance. Oh, it is a... An iris violet sweetness. A soft, soft, powdery, super powdery. If you do not like powdery fragrance, you will not like this one. Super powdery violet sweetness candiness. Mm, but it's very powdery. If you don't like powdery scents, you will not like this one. Oh, guys. Thank you, Gabriella. This is the bomb. I also love your channel. And the video that I um, watched this in was like a blind buy video. <laughs> so funny. We have so much in common. <laughs> Guys, yes. Uh, I will link all the videos that I watched these um, perfumes that made me buy them in the description bar. So check those out. Oh, this one's so good. When I first sprayed it, I'm not going to lie, I was scared because it's a little old school. It's a little old school and heavy on the powder, okay? I don't know if iris is the powdery note or violet, but it's one of those. 
Mm -hmm. But on your skin. When I first sprayed, I was scared because it was so powdery, but on your skin, it kind of um, just gets really clean. Mm. Mm. And like a baby doll's face powdery, if that makes sense. I always say that and I don't know, but I really like this one. Thank you, Gabriella. You're the bomb. Okay, next. This one I love, 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 and I'm so glad I found her channel. She's not active anymore, but I'm sure you guys have watched her too if you guys love fragrances. And it's, I think it's It's Jody. I'm not sure. I will link the video down below. But she raved about um, Armani Code Cashmere. And she is the reason I blind bought this fragrance. And I'm so glad she did. She talked about it because, guys, this is like, I feel like my signature scent, if I didn't have so many, <laughs> this would be my signature scent. Yes. Love it. She's the bomb. Love your channel. Don't know where you are or when you're going to post a new one. But I'm here for it. I'm subscribed. Notifications are on. And this next one. She is so funny. She is so funny. Amber Chantel, what's up, girl? You are hilarious. I laugh at your videos all the dang time. Guys, when she mentioned this one, it was like her number one in her summer sense. And I had to get it. I had to get it. And I got this. Um. Yeah, anyways, I'm just giving. I, I did a haul video with this in it and I didn't say her name. Be, you know, I feel like it's kind of like a, like an unspoken thing. Like, don't say where you got it from because then it takes away from you as a reviewer. Making shit up in my head. <laughs> Anyways, Amber, you're the reason why I bought I Love Love by Moschino, which I freaking love, by the way. I love it. Thank you. She said it was like Dolce Gabbana light blue for half the price. And when she said that, I was like, I am there. Cheap is my middle name. And it is from their Cheap and Chic line. Guys, this is a Dolce Gabbana light blue, more orange, which I love the orange note. And the musk on here is so sexy, especially like if you're in the sun and your body is heating up. This is super duper fresh and sexy, fresh, sexy. You will be getting compliments out the hoo-ha, okay? I I've worn this three times in public. One time I would got in a sauna with other women and I got compliments from all the women. They're like, is that you? A little that heat just brought like radiated uh, this musk and tea rose in here and orange it's good it's good and I really like this one I actually prefer it over Dolce Gabbana light blue and I think it lasts longer it lasts really long on me but I've heard other people say it doesn't so I don't know but anyways Amber thank you you're hilarious dude anyway yeah. Okay, guys. And my number one blind buy slash YouTube made me buy it was thanks to Rhonda. Rhonda, I don't know how to say your last name and I don't want to butcher it, so I'm not going to say it. But I also know you as Perfume Maven on Instagram. Guys, Rhonda I, Rhonda, I love your collection. I love your channel. I love that you rock with the cheap scents and you rock with the celebrity scents. Um, a lot of the, um, if you guys haven't noticed, celebrity scents get a lot of um, pooey looks from people. But I don't care because guess what? My celebrity scents are the ones that give me the most compliments, honestly. <laughs> Yeah, guys, um, my celebrity scents are the ones that give me the most compliments. And this celebrity scent that I got because of Rhonda's recommendation, it was her top, um, it was her top celebrity scent in her collection. And she has like, I think she probably has over a hundred by now. I don't know. I know she's been doing some decluttering. So anyways, guys, the fragrance, none other than Onika by Nicki Minaj. Mm. It is a pear, it's a pear and sugar 
pear and sugar pear balm and sugar it's super duper sweet oh. but classy Mm, I love this one so much, so much, so much. And longevity is not great, but I don't mind respraying. Oh, guys, I've only had this one for a couple of months. And I'm deep, deep, or I'm, I, I already feel like I need to buy another bottle. <laughs> I love this one. And thank you, Rhonda, for all the content you put out because I love it all. Um, guys, yes. So those are a few of my favorite YouTubers and the stuff that they made me buy. Guys, um, I appreciate you all. Like I said, leave your questions down below for the Q&A. Um, I appreciate all the love and support. You guys are always out here. Like, you guys are great. You guys are the greatest subscribers I could ask for. And I appreciate you. And yeah, guys, peace. Outro. Bye-bye. I think I'm done. Hopefully, don't.